Hey, so I've been away for quite a while now, right? So let's start off with a good note for once. Remember my friend that I said was placed into a medically induced coma because he suffered a head trauma during serving time in Iraq? Well, he's now woken up. So welcome back, Daniel. Good to have you back. In reality, I've already interrogated you as to what happened. I can't actually tell you, audience, why. But yeah, he's awake and that's all that counts. So that's good. On a bad note, I have had like a triage of failure because yesterday, um, if you aren't aware, then there's a gaming channel that I have and I'm currently playing Dragon Age 2 on there. And I accidentally deleted every single video from 1 to 30. <clears throat> so I tried recovering them, and most of the files were either very much damaged, or too corrupt, or could not even be retrieved. So today I've had to replay most of the game that I already played, and now I've gotten enough videos back, so it's back into order again, so for the people who do watch them then it's going to start continuing properly again after, well, alongside this vlog, so yeah that's fine. Uh, another bad thing that happened was... Today I wake up, I suppose I have a test in computer systems and network technology. I leave my house at ten past seven. I get to the bus stop just about at twenty past seven. And the bus goes... There's no other buses until eight o'clock, which means I wouldn't get to the train until twenty to nine. Which means I won't get to uni until half past nine. And my test started at nine. So I had to miss that whatever happened. So I just came home and I went to bed. But the strange thing was, when I was walking up to the road, I was walking up to the road, I saw one magpie. So I was like, okay, bad luck. What's going to happen? I missed the bus. On the way back down, I see two. I'm like, okay, what's good going to happen now? And today, nothing really good has happened. And then this evening, I find out that Daniel's woken up. And is currently talking to me on MSN, so yeah, I'm not one for superstitious stuff or whatever, but that's kind of weird. Hell of a coincidence, but it's damn good nonetheless, right? Also, I should note that Dragon Age 2 is a very awesome game, and I recommend you buy it. If you're not sure whether you want to buy it or not, go to my channel up there and look at it, because I'm giving you a playthrough of just my path. There's millions of different paths, a few different endings, and there's different ways to get through the game, so it's not going to be the same as what I'm showing you either, so it's not going to be the same for you if you play it. So yeah, go ahead and check it out. I've also been playing Two Worlds 2, that's awesome. Kind of glitchy, kind of... Takes a little while to get used to the controls, but it's good. Maybe not worth the wait, but it was, it's good anyway, I haven't beat it yet. I also managed to play a bit of Homefront in the intro scene, and... Oh! my god, that intro scene is so dark. Like, it's got people getting shot in the face and bodies being dragged and two people end up against the wall. There's Koreans shooting at them and then the kid screams because his parents have just been shot before his face. Two Koreans walk away and he just runs towards his parents, his corpse. And I was like, oh, that was crippling. That was awful. Good. Good scene setter, though. So well done to whoever makes that game, because that was pretty damn good. Also excited for Uncharted 3. Any other games I can think of? Mass Effect 3 when that comes out sometime later this year as well. I think that's about it for games. Yeah, I won't mention Gears of War 3 because I don't actually like that game. Sorry James, Jack, Steve, all my friends. <laughs> Apart from David, he doesn't like it either, so that's good. Yay for David. I have also decided to buy a new hard drive. No, I didn't. I decided to buy a new graphics card. And I'm going to buy that sometime soon. And I'm going to get that one to run alongside my one, hopefully. And then I can have my graphics card now for my displays. And I can have the new graphics card purely dedicated to games. So that'll be good, right? And then obviously my videos on this channel will get better. You've probably also noticed that I keep pointing to it quite a lot and that's because I haven't got very many subscribers on there yet. Not many of you have followed me across. So, you know. If you click on this button, 
you can subscribe to it without leaving this and if you click on this button you actually go to the channel and you, and you can actually watch videos and I upload one every day unless I fuck up and delete everything then I kind of have to wait a little bit but generally there's one per day there's also a moderator module on that channel where you can leave suggestions for new games you want to see me play and also as always go into my channel go to moderator module and ask questions for Q&A 8 I know I'm delayed with Q&A 7 but that will come on sometime soon I'm kind of slightly backtracked because Uniwix has been quite hectic in the last vlog I mentioned I was doing an AI game finished that, it's quite good now, thank you to Jack now I'm currently working on a programming simulation of the asteroids thing but it's not really asteroids because you just got things moving across the screen and then they collide and bounce I haven't got to that bounce part yet but everything else works quite fine and also with regards to the passport it's finally came back from my person I went to design it and it's been sent off to the passport application agency and they have taken the money from my bank which means it got there so that should be processed roughly soon and I'm not actually sure about America at the moment I'm not sure if it's going to happen if it's not going to happen Thankfully I haven't booked anything yet, so I'm fine whatever happens, but yeah, I'm not sure if I will be going or not, definitely in May the 23rd. I don't know. <sighs> and also, as I want to provoke comments from you people, because you're quite mute, even though I get plenty of views, um, leave a comment below of some kind of weird coincidental thing has happened to you, which ties in with superstitious beliefs or something like that. Like, yeah. Because that magpie thing was quite, it's weird. It's very weird. And that's all I needed to say for this video. It's quite short, but it's prompt. And I'll see you sometime with the next one soon. It might be the Q&A 7 or it might be another vlog. I'm not sure which way I'm going to work it yet. But yeah, remember, go to the channel to watch gameplay commentary and footage it does get better and it gets quite funny go to my channel leave questions for Q&A 8 I'll extend the deadline so it lasts a bit longer than next week because Q&A 7 will probably be next week and yeah I wish you all the best and health feel free to subscribe and leave comments because I appreciate them click on the annotations around my place to just navigate around my channel and the other channel and just do stuff because I like interaction with you so please leave comments about anything I've said in this video and superstitious coincidental occurrences if they've occurred go into my channel as I just said and subscribe for my game and stuff if it interests you, if it doesn't then fine I understand feel free to share these videos, all this lovely lovely stuff and yeah I will see you in the next one sometime soon I also need a haircut. Ha. Arrivederci, Mr. Bye.